Hi guys and welcome back to another um, SimFlight Sequatory YouTube video. Um, as always, we're going to be here, but this is going to be the first time in this channel that we're going to make a tutorial. What tutorial we're gonna do today? Um, we're going to um, see how to install the A330 of Tami of the default because um, in some days more we're going to do it, but for uh, Aerosoft. And now we're going to install the library that is just uh, for the default A330 that you can use it in your F6 uh, prepared no matter what version. And so let's start with it. So first of all, as always, you're going to go to your um, to your uh, browser that you want to use it. I'm here in Microsoft browser. Um, you're going to find here in 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 Portuguese. I mean in Portuguese, Abyssal Arch. This is the page. I'm going to put the link below in the description box in order to just enter to it. Um, and you're going to find here an Abyssal Arch here. Tami. Because we're going to use the default Tami. Here you're going to find the A320. I mean, we're not going to install this by this time. And here you're going to find the Airbus A330 200 Tami TR. Okay, you're going to enter. Here you can read it if you know how to speak Portuguese. I don't know. Um, okay, so you're going to go below. And here you 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 can find two ways for download it by for sure me i think is the name of this one and mega that is the one that i like so i already uh, downloaded as you can see and you're going to press here enter to your account and download it okay so that's it so let's open the the folder here we have this folder and and what you're going to do now, you're going to go to your uh, the, the directory of your B3D or FZX. I don't know if it works in Flight Simulator 24. I, don't, I think no, but if you want to try it also there, do it and tell me in the comments if you if it's working pretty good. So we are here inside our B3D version 4.5. What you're going, you're going to do if you have P3D, go or F6, go to your same subjects. Now, planes in here. What you're going to do, drop this folder into this one, okay? We're going to wait. I already have it, so I'm going to replace it. There it is. What you're going to do next, you're going to go back to your main full main simulator and here you are going to open this this one and you're going to copy this to folder named gauges and effects and drop it into your p3d or fsx main folder replace it and that's it and now we're going to go inside our p3d in order to take all the boxes in order to see if it's working pretty good or not and you're going to see that even this is p3d version uh 4.5 it's going to work uh, because when i i uh, was more young i used to use it but in f6 and we're talking about 2012 or or 13 and it it is a lot of time but believe me it's going to work pretty good without any problem so let's go to in into it so here we are inside our P3D and I already chose um, the, the plane here as you can see it seems quite nice and let's change our location here we're going to go to Sierra Elko Quebec Mike uh, that's Kito, Kito Zerper and uh, let's just fly so guys we are here and as you can see it's quite modulated outside the plane. Here is our Tame A330. I like it. Here we are in Kito Serper, as you can see. Um, you also have the, the the winds view. There is a cockpit, but it's not um, modulated. It's not work, work, uh, working quite good. It seems <laughs> pretty ugly and disgusting, but as you can see, you have 
many views in order to enjoy your fly and here you have the the always the, the default cockpit as you already I think you you already know how it is in FSX or pre 3 d and some buttons are not working obviously but lights are working pretty good you're going to have lights um, you also have the GPS you also can do ILS landings because I made a lot of ILS landing when I used to use this plane because now I'm using the iris of Tame and that's it and that's it and I hope you like this this first tutorial and hope you get subscribed and don't forget to give a like to this uh, this video and that's it bye bye see you into the next one